The world is turned into a global hive of negativity, the masses broken from nature competing to achieve false vitality. In the sociopathic age of the young, they stay heedless to the changes that have begun, paying no regard to the potential environmental aftermath. Society is trapped by conformity, deaf to the crying earth that she screams, rise up, rise up, never considering the consequence to the lack of their common sense. Your disguise only brings your demise like the veil lifted from the uneasy and disregarded eyes of today's society, like the third world poverty hidden in our own backyards, like the unwanted native history that now uncovers this country anxiety. The belly of the beast caters propaganda served on the plates of our seeds to come. Sweet Mother Earth has done more than what the human race has done. Don't turn your blind eye from the destruction, the crashing, the burning, as the pipelines carry more emptiness from north to south, more corruption to the human health. There's no rest for the wicked, thus the plot thickens. With the progression of the revolution, all the water warriors have revealed Uncle Sam's extortion. Consider this confrontation one mark towards my people's oppression. Standing steadfast and vigilant, fist raised as we move forward, in higher consciousness, no longer allowing displacement, we will always fight against injustice. We are the answers to our ancestors' prayers through these shifting times, as we become one with our bodies, spirits, and minds. Generations have relied on the stars, moon, and many suns. The prophecies ended with the fifth and starts with the sixth. As we idle no more with global movements, we begin to shake humanity as we re reconnect through the journeys of peace and dignity. With our moccasins on, a gr on the ground announcing to the world that we are the children of the sun, we are earth guardians coming forth for the next era enlightenment has begun. Thank you.